-hmm. So what does Hedron do? So Hedron on its own, it is, it is mintable for having T-shares. You can advance borrow it. It's kind of like you put it, you put it in a very eloquent way, a decentralized credit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how I like to describe it. Yeah. I, I love that. I love mm -hmm. that. Um, can you kind of uh, run on that just a bit, just to really hit that home? Like what you mean by mm -hmm. decentralized credit? Yeah. So the decentralized credit that I talk about with Hedron refers to the advanced feature. Mm -hmm. And for uh, I'm sure a lot of people in your chat know, and, and you included debt. Um, using debt as a means to advance your financial situation is very important in our current like economic landscape. You know, you take on debt to open a business, you take on debt to get a mortgage, you take on debt to like do things with substantial size that like your normal job just you would take too long to get via just saving up. Mm -hmm. And so, but all of the debt that we need in order to like propel ourselves forward economically, there is some kind of centralized party that you're going to, to get those funds from. And that's like not really a problem. Like that's kind of inherent to like what debt is. You're borrowing money. It has to come somewhere. Mm -hmm. But we exist in this space where we really value decentralization, uh, counterpartyless systems, trustless systems, where we don't have to rely on somebody else and somebody else's terms. We would rather just deal with ourselves and some kind of code base. And that's mm -hmm. exactly what these HSIs allow us to do. We can take an advance on the system that we're participating in relative to the number of hedron we're entitled to over time. And really, in a way, we're taking that um, debt against the liquidity that exists. You know, however much the, the, those coins cost, we can get an advance um, uh, of those hedron tokens whenever we want with the terms laid set in stone and clear for us to understand before we do it. Mm -hmm. And so this is just another example, just like Hex gave decentralized trustless yield to individuals and the power that there is in that hedron gives the individual decentralized trustless uh credit and debt which can be dangerous and can be um harmful if used incorrectly but if used correctly is extremely empowering and mm -hmm. extremely useful uh for this kind of world we're trying to manifest where we have decentralized financial.